Okay, nandito po tayo sa Barangay Katuslao sa may Kanduni. And we're on top of a mountain or hill somewhere. Ang kita nyo po, ayan yung po yung view natin dito. So, somebody spent a lot of money putting up this place here in the middle of nowhere to put up a coffee shop. So, there are the guys. Nagkakape sa bukid. So what you're looking at is where well, are the mountains of Kanduni. Nandito po tayo sa barangay Katuslao. And that's, those are our bikes. And uh, this is the place where we had coffee. It's Ed Seals Nature Sky Deck. We passed by a few other places going this way. But this one seems to be conveniently located uh, beside the road. So, dito kami pumarada. So, ang ganda ng view dito. Grabe. And even the, the path going here. So, I wasn't able to take a video of that. But I'm hoping to uh, capture all of, the, all of that later. So, stay tuned. Wow, spectacular! And the road here is really good quality. Yung problem lang is there are areas na may dumaputek. Eh, kasi nga siguro kakatapos lang ng odet, so hindi pa masadu malines. And there's plenty of twisties here, if that's what you're looking for. And this is really not a place to be, you know, if you're a big bike, it's not a place to really go fast. The roads here are, are best for, you know, easy cruising. If you're a small bike, you'll appreciate it because uh, probably it's just right yung twists and turns dito. But for a big bike, parang nagkukruise ka lang can't really go that fast because yun nga maraming buhangin and if it's raining here for sure there are sections um, of the road na medyo madulas tulad nito oh, loose gravel yung mga kasama ko po ngayon yung tinatawag natin na mga sabadista <laughs> <laughs> no, not, not the religion. Um, we ride Saturdays. Kasi nga, uh, you know, there are, we have other commitments on Sundays. Like me, you know, on Sundays, it's uh, it's a time na sineset aside natin para sa Panginoon and sa, sa family na rin, ano? Yeah, so we ride um, Saturdays. And the other guys here are married na rin, may mga anak. So, and things to do on a Sunday. So, eto, nagra-ride ng Saturday. And, yung maganda, pag nagra-ride ka Saturday, wala masyadong kompetensya sa daan. It's not like when you ride um, Sundays. There's just so many um, people on the road. Like, this road here, I'm, I'm pretty sure that it's so full of small bikes, cyclists and um, SUVs um, on Sundays kasi look at this place it's beautiful and the roads only twisties <laughs> and the pace that we're going around 60, 70 so Perfect lang talaga for the road conditions. Of course, you can go faster. But really, it's not the type of road for it. So, there's four of us in the group. Um, 
In front of me is a 40th anniversary GS. Very cool looking uh, bike right there. Behind me is Eric, you've seen in my previous video. Is the yellow Suzuki V Strom, just like mine. But mine is black. And a Ninja 400. And reputedly, that Ninja 400 rides like a ZH1, ZH2. <laughs> it's a very nice road. And just ease into it. Don't race. And medyo umuulan ng konti, pero it doesn't seem like it's gonna be a big downpour. Hopefully we'll get out of the mountains by... before it really gets wet. Because you see that, it can get really slippery. So wala masyadong tao sa daan. Plus the fact siguro na it's, it's 12 o'clock. So most people are in their homes eating or probably sleeping and it's a Saturday so it's really nice here no, I, I wish I could put up a vacation house here but <laughs> you're gonna have a hard time finding internet <laughs> and even electricity at this time especially na kakatapos lang ng Odette so many dead trees there as you can see so coming here we pass by um Yung bayan ng Dangkalan. And coming from Kabangkalan, we turn left. Coming in here. And supposedly, there's a road being built right now connecting to Hinobaan. And uh, hopefully, that gets built and completed soon. And uh, so that next time, um, you could just cross over to Hinobaan passing this way. And for sure, lots of people would pass this way once that road is completed. Because it's a very scenic route. And the people here will probably appreciate the... The people coming by, you know, for tourism and that will raise the prices of the land here and hopefully they get benefit from it. I'd say give this one more year and this place will be really, really awesome to uh, travel, travel through. But it's not so bad as it is now, you know. So there are cyclists going here too. These guys came all the way from Sipalay. We, we met them on the, uh, the coffee shop. So they've been, like, been riding all morning, going there. So it's like, I don't know, maybe a total of 120 kilometers going through mountains. These kids, they got all the energy. Kami nga, nagbumotor lang. Hirap na, hirap na eh. Hindi <laughs> ko ma-imagine. Iba bike mo. To be honest, this is really country, deep into the mountains kind of road. It just happens to be really nice. Very 
very little traffic that is if you pass by here on a Saturday <laughs> it's like you have the whole road to yourself very nice look at that Look at that view over there. Beautiful. Beautiful. So, kayo po, if you're looking for a spot to ride, whether you're cycling or riding a motorcycle, put on the map sa calendar nyo. Ito po yung bayan ng Kanduni. And uh, you won't get disappointed. So, ito po yung bayan ng Kanduni. This is like the town proper. So, it's a decent size. You know, it's a typical town that you pass through along the Negros Highways. Hindi naman talaga ganun ka kalaki, but it's decent. Want to yung twisties dito? <laughs> it's not fast turns, but you know, it's a lot of turns. Hindi bakbakan yung ride dito. Ano lang, cruise lang. Easy, easy lang. Kasi you can't eh. Now with the amount of twists and turns here. I think this place is best for the cruiser. Because... You know, easy turns. So if you have a Harley, bring it here. You're gonna have a lot of fun. I'll make a mental note to bring a Harley here once I get a Harley again. It's just perfect. For Just an awesome place. Right. 
makatayo nga muna Mala yan, nagtataka kayo Nagtataka kayo <laughs> Ba't ako nakatayo? Hindi po ako nagpapasikat Ang sakit na ako ng puwet ko <laughs> So yan po, <laughs> if you're still here at this time, at this point Malapit sang oras po na twisties One hour twisties lang ng twisties Hindi <laughs> naman siguro one hour pero, you know, non-stop But if you're riding uh, probably a scooter, one hour maybe more Twisties lang ng twisties One to sawa twisties Pero I think if you are on a Smaller bike Siguro scooter Ma-appreciate nyo talaga to Yung road na to Maybe it's a little bit tight for big bikes, but maybe not. I mean, we're just chilling here. But if you're on a sport bike, probably not the best of places to be riding because you would want fast turns on a sport bike. Adventure bikes, good. Small bikes, good. Cruisers, perfect. Well, that's just me. <laughs> okay, I can see the beach. So I guess that ends our Kanduni adventure. Look at that view. I wonder what's the prize in that view. <laughs> So okay, kita po tayo sa susunod na video. Salamat sa iyong panonood. And maybe we'll visit another place some other time. So for now, this has been N Biker. Thank you for watching.